Hey, what's up guys? I'm Marty and this is Kakadoodle Farm. So like most little girls, my daughter Emma wanted to build a castle. So she found this piece of wood and sketched out this castle that she wanted to build. So my dad took her design and built her this, a real castle. Never thought there'd be the day that Amazon made coffee. Let's see how it is. Had to do that inside today because people are still sleeping inside. We can't risk waking anybody up. Our little boy cat here. We're calling him Moon Doggy. Don't ask why. But he's still living inside and we're trying to migrate him outside slowly. He's still getting used to all the other cats and just being outside in general. He wants to be inside, but he cannot be an indoor cat. But he has been a super sweet cat. He's really fun to, the kids really been enjoying him, having him around. But it's getting about time for him to move outside. You know, it's kind of interesting. I think for the first time, I don't have videos like stacked up, ready to go, or at least ready to be edited. I think it's because we're kind of falling into a routine around here. Because usually there's something obvious that we're working on or that the animals are doing or that we're getting new animals or there's just something very obvious to post. But for the first time now, I don't have that obvious thing. And it's kind of nice. I think it's because we might be starting to fall into a little bit of a groove here. What, you two? Hi, Bisky. I feel like overrun by animals. <laughs> Relax, Bisky. I got three cats on my lap and a dog. Go crazy. It's not bad, actually. Okay. Come on. There actually has been a project that we've been working on over the last couple months that I haven't shown anybody online yet. Um, I'm really excited to show you guys because it was an idea that Emma had that my dad literally brought to life. And you're not gonna believe it when you see it. And you know, I'm bummed because I took some footage of us building this thing um, and I lost a majority of it. But what I did save is here. So yeah, these blocks were massive. So the first step was just to figure out how to cut them. So my dad took the coils out of a space heater and built this crazy contraption to sort of slice through the blocks. Once we had them all cut, we set them into place. Then we remember we probably should get the ground ready first. So we did that.
So yeah, this is where we're at and it's not even done yet, but this is just some styrofoam. We got to reinforce it, put another coat on because it kind of chips off a little easy. So there's still some work to do like on the structure itself, um, but it looks freaking awesome. The kids already love it. The plan is, is to build in some playground stuff and some like ninja stuff, some ropes and stuff that they can go from one section to another. So there's certainly still a lot of work to be done on this. upstairs we're gonna put a ladder here actually maybe like a drawbridge or something i don't know we got crazy ideas but for now it's a ladder and this is actually a big hole that we just covered up but we want to put a flagpole in there so the kids can slide down with a big flag on top you know i don't know it is certainly an ambitious project um, it's taken us a couple months just to get to this point, but hopefully the kids don't get sick of this like they get sick of everything else in a couple weeks, so Which they probably will But I think I think we should take this and like hang it up inside the castle So yeah, I mean I guess besides building a castle um, There's not a whole lot new going on So I already fed the animals this morning, but let's take a little walk and see how they're all doing So we got our little baby chicks in here. Well, they're not our babies. They're like our teenage chicks. We keep our babies inside in like a little stock tank. Um, these guys move out to this little hoop house and start to free range a little bit. And pretty soon they'll be out free ranging with our other friends out here. It also allows them to all get used to each other. And give you a little update on these piglets too because they're actually going to their new homes tomorrow so let's go see them before they leave well guys thanks for watching today we'll continue to give updates on the progress on our little castle there but i wanted to get it in now before winter came because i have a feeling not much else is going to happen to that castle before next spring. So that's what kind of prompted getting this video out now. But I hope you all have a wonderful day and we'll see you next time. Bye.